Right now, a school board is reviewing resumes. Yeah, the candidates could become Brevard County's interim superintendent, replacing Dr. Mark Mullins, who a majority of board members wanted to step down. News 6's James Barbero takes us inside the special meeting at district headquarters. We have three people that made the top three. The Brevard County School Board scoring the resumes of 12 candidates for interim superintendent and narrowing those applicants to Mark Rendell, James Larson, and Robert Schiller. Rendell is the principal of Cocoa Beach Junior Senior High School and used to be superintendent in Indian River County. Larson works in the Orange County Schools administrative offices and Schiller has interim leadership experience in California, Maryland, and Virginia. These are our three that we kind of all collaboratively agree that they scored the highest. Uh, do we get the opportunity now to speak with them and interview them uh, before making any decisions? We're the 49th largest school district in the United States of America. Um, and I don't think we hire someone to run it uh, based off of simply a resume. So I think it's our due diligence to invite them here or via Zoom, obviously. Board members will attempt to book those interviews this Thursday or Friday and potentially vote for a winner Tuesday next week. I think this is really important. It gives our community some time to give their input as well. The board's choice will officially be named to the office on New Year's Day, the day after Dr. Mark Mullins formally resigns. The outgoing superintendent reaching a separation agreement with the district last week. And I'm confident that uh, leadership will continue to uh, do the right thing for kids and uh, take the district to great heights. Parents can share their opinion on the search for the interim superintendent during public comment tonight. In Vieira, Brevard County, I'm James Sparvero getting results news 6.